All right, Adam Scott now. He's got a fly, maybe? He's begging for it. To, oh, gosh. That's not good. That's that. a big time miss. <clears throat> All right, JT now needs to kind of not focus on those two, focus here on his. Yeah, this one headed lucky. left as well, Jim. Get lucky. Left! Mm, and that done. finds a penalty area as well. Wow, wow, those are two big mistakes. Justin Thomas, Shane Lowry, and Adam Scott. I got a couple of tee shots out of position. Yeah, you be careful, careful Bones. Now go slightly to your right. You should be right at your feet. Right right You're right on it. There might be other things in there too at your feet. The reality is, if you can't see the ball, it's not going to be playable. Kind of doing the same. I mean, what do you think? Maybe just on the other side of that, is that a leaf or something? Leaf. What do you think? Yeah. I mean, it has to be. I mean, obviously, they were looking in. Yeah. I think ours are pretty similar, just dis different distances, right? I don't think you do. I think you have to drop it on, like, the lineup. We can come get a rules official. I only, the only reason I say that is because at PGA, something similar happened, and like I, I was told that I could, but I think I was, I got an incorrect ruling. We'll just call an official. Yeah, please. Kind of sorting all of this out. Meanwhile, Shane Lowry will play as we wait for a rules official. And I'll give you my explanation as to why Adam Scott wanted to drop in the first cut then as Lowry plays from the first cut in the right-hand side. Just 87 yards. And that was a very ordinary shot that has turned out really, really well. That got a very fortunate break. And now he's got an easy putt up the hill. So Adam Scott mentioned its point of entry and then you can go back as far as you like now if he came back on that direct line he'd be right on the edge of the fairway I looking to bounce you for I, I think it's Shane very Lowry. I, I, I think it's very easily could have crossed we'll listen in to JT basically if Adam Scott goes back on a direct line he's on the edge of the fairway he wants to play from the first cut to take a little bit of spin off it. He's worried that playing the full wedge from the fairway, he'll create too much backspin. He wants to be able to just fly it and stop it out of the first cut. Here. Now, when I drop, can I use one? No, I don't think it means it's from directly on the corner line path. Now, right. Wait. Okay. You know what happen. Yeah, I it can roll up to a club link yeah, anywhere? After, yeah, it can roll up to a club link, but it has to be on that line when you drop it. Okay. Yep. Now that we have heard the explanation for the ruling, <laughs> I can tell you it's the exact opposite to what I just said. The, like we're across? So, Do you mind just, no problem? Because yeah. it's obviously close, but we don't, I don't think either one of us want to make the... <laughs> We thought they were both, give or take, a couple basically yards either way. I mean, it's very, very close, but it's right there on that, okay. yeah, on that line. Yeah, I yeah. just wanted to ask why we had you. Of course. Where is, like, a hook to you? Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I'm coming in retrospectively, so I mean, I... Uh, nice. I, I just, I see what you're saying. This is, a, this, this is almost you, a straight angle from the team. I mean, I, I'm just trying to put it in perspective. I would say start line was here-ish, yeah. and they're right here. So, I mean, yeah, if you're looking at it in that sense, it would kind of be somewhere near this, which would be closer to probably the clean up in that state. So would, you, would do we just split the difference between what maybe like this would show and 
where we just threw these down. I know. Yeah. Again, just coming in, all, all I can just tell you guys, is, you know, you know, you're gonna have to make your best to assessment. Be okay with it? I mean, no. I mean, I think you guys. I mean, if you guys are there, you, you know, it makes sense with the straight line there that if you if you want to. It looks too modify. straight to me. It does to me too. And yours just was more a similar ball flight. I mean, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just on the other side of that bridge. What happened was, both the tee shots of Adam Scott and Justin Thomas were hooking to the left. Now, where it crossed with this creek that runs from left to right is what we're trying to determine. So Shane Lowry coming in to add his understanding. We'll show you the tee shots because we have the footage. Here's Adam Scott. Well, that stake that was pretty far forward might be a little more accurate. JT. Ultimately, at the end of the day, the only people that matter in this situation are the players, as long as they agree to it. You guys, you guys were all standing. I mean, you, try to, you try to make the best. We're going to use reason. I'd say you could easily yep. see the red stake. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I wouldn't say that is going to. Okay. Let's use reasonable judgment. We'll, we'll use that as a point. Okay. Okay. Do you just think, I mean, mine I, I think it's the of yours is the very same. Okay. Like I think it's. Right. So I, I certainly, I certainly don't think it's up left here where you have to go back. I, I reckon you're going to be able to get it back this way. All right. Thanks, James. Yeah, oh, we yeah. just didn't. Except uh, for making me walk yeah. 150 yards. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. When every shot is on global television and you've got people scrutinizing it on social media, yeah, absolutely. It only takes one person to chime in and say, hey, what about that? You know, and given his position right now, he's inside the cut line. And God forbid if there was something weird with the penalty, that would be brutal. Adam Scott. Well, it's not easy to refocus after all of this as well. Just a wedge in hand. Good angle. It's not a difficult shot. He's now just got to reset. Oh, boy. That was straight over the flag. It's going to leave a very slick putt from above the hole. Goes to show how wonderful this stream is to see every shot of these players, the best players in the world. They all do mess up. I am, yeah. Okay. Yeah, because I was going to look for the place. not, but I like to find this like one, or, one or two passes. There you go. Thank you. Now, JT. It's to just a wedge. I would expect this inside Adam Scott's ball. Yeah, I would say two decent shots. Thanks for watching the PJ Tour on YouTube. To watch another video, click here.